All right, fancy instrumental. By the age of 25, West Coast guitarist Steve Mann had already performed and recorded with the likes of Sonny and Cher, Janis Joplin, Hoyt Axton, Ry Cooter, Dr. John, Taj Mahal, and many others, and was an acoustic guitar icon on the West Coast. His inventive guitar arrangements were legendary among blues aficionados, and he influenced players like Jorma Kaukonen, Stefan Grossman, and Paul Jeremiah, among many others. Then Steve had a nervous breakdown and was diagnosed with schizophrenia. He disappeared. Friends put out albums of studio and live recordings, but Steve was gone into a maze of mental facilities, halfway houses, and hard times living on the streets. After nearly 40 years, with the help of friends, Will Scarlett and Janet Smith, Steve has re-emerged in Berkeley, California. He still lives with mental illness, and he still plays some fine guitar. The video which follows was recorded in January of 2008 in Berkeley, California. Here's Steve's take on the Ray Charles piano style. Your day will come. 
I said, if you live, your day will come. So, child, don't you mess with that cotton sack. It's gonna scratch your knees and scrape your back. And if you live, your time will come.